So it's so difficult to decide what to wear when you live in New England. I don't know, it says the weather forecast for today was that it was gonna be cloudy and even thunderstorms. So I dressed accordingly, but it is beautiful out. There's not a cloud in the sky. The sun is shining. It's 67 degrees at 8.30 this morning, and I don't know. Anyway, so one of the things that I wanted to talk about today is um, being able to check in with yourself, to see where you're at, to constantly monitor and be aware of things that are going on in your body, um, behaviors, right? Some of the thoughts and behaviors that you may be having. It's so important for recovery to just kind of like constantly check in. That's, that's the only way I, I think I can um, phrase it. It's from It's been my experience that if I wait for things to get a little bit heavy, it's too heavy, right? And so I find myself, if I have to say to myself, um, it's no big deal, or I can handle it, or you know, whatever, if I'm saying those words, it is a big deal, right? If I'm saying, oh, it's a small thing, it's not a small thing. If I even have to say those words, because what happens is, is my mind tries to, um, get rid of any stress that it may be enduring. And so some of the ways that it will do that is to ignore, distract, procrastinate, right? So my mind will do that to protect myself. It's a survival skill, right? So I don't get into that fight or flight. Um, or it actually is a little fight or flight response. Anyway, so this constantly checking in monitors before it gets to that point where I'm um, stressing out. Um, I kind of lost my, my train of thought in the middle of that sentence. <laughs> uh, so constantly checking in with yourself to see where you're at so that you can use some tools or you know do something uh, to reduce that, to, to uh, face it head on before it becomes something that is too heavy, before it's out of control, too stressful, uh, too overwhelming, right? We tend to wait until things are in crisis before we respond. And what I'm talking about is learning how to uh, identify and recognize when you are at the start of that, start to creep. And one of the ways to do that is to constantly check in myself. What am I thinking? What are my thoughts? What are my behaviors, right? Where am I at right now? Have I eaten? Have I slept? All of that. So important. Um, I hope you have a wonderful day. I hope the sun is shining where you are at. Um, you know, I hope you remember to let the people that you love know that you love them. Send them that text. Give them a call. Give them a great big hug every chance you get. Live your life enthusiastically. Live your life mindfully. Live your life with gratitude. And until next time, guys, please stay blessed.